For example, when we look at, you know, the way that we structure gender today through most of the world, especially the global north, we have this very binary system of boys and girls. But the truth is there have been cultures all over the world, all throughout history that have had more than just two genders or who haven't had the same defining features of these genders, that they don't have the male roles and the female roles played out the same way that we do. And so you have to start to ask yourself when you're presented with that, you know, does it make more sense to say that this one way of thinking has steamrolled over the rest of the world and, and now that's just dominance and that's what we go with? Or does it make more sense to say that all of these other cultures were just liberals that were like, you know, trying to change things and, and, and come up with their neo pronouns or whatever, right? It doesn't really work that way. Um, and so the, the simple fact is sex and gender and sexuality are completely disjointed from each other. They're completely different things. 